Now, if you go to Etsy and search Squarespace templates, you'll find a bunch of uh, example listings that you can reference. Um, you'll also notice that there are Etsy sellers who are paying for ads specifically for this keyword. So here's a sample listing and you've got some product photos, which are going to be your template pages, maybe the home page, a couple of the inside pages, uh, as well as um, some guidelines on what to expect and how it works. You will also notice uh, in your description, this is where you'll add your your uh, your demo links as well as all the details about what's included and so on. So how do we get started? Now, if you go to the bottom of any Etsy page, I'm already logged in, but if I wasn't logged in, there'd be a link here that says uh, start selling or get started selling or something related to selling. It'll be right down here. Um, and so once you do that, you'll follow some prompts, which will prompt you to create your first listing. So I'm going to go through what those prompts look like now. And uh, this is pretty much it, right? So once you go through that listing process, the very first step is to add your product photos. Uh, a video is helpful, always. Uh, your template name, uh, about it, who made it, you know, what is it, when did you make it? And then your category, you're going to do uh, website templates for your, for your category. And you'll have another opportunity to add a tag. Um, but anyway, you're going to change your type from physical product to a digital product. And then you can select whether you want this listing to renew automatically or if you want to do it manually. And so it looks like it's 20 cents each time. And then here's the tag where you're going to add Squarespace template, your price, quantity, and then for personalization, turn that on and then add uh, enter or, you know, please enter uh, the email where you want to receive the template all right and then da, 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 da. so then we're at this is a little bit different i'm going to click publish but it's not going to let me because i haven't uploaded any photos or changed the inventory or added a description so or even a title all right um, so for this video, I'm not going to do all of that, but you know, this is where you'd obviously do all of those things. Um, and then you just go straight to publish. Now, if this was your first time doing it, um, you actually wouldn't see all of this at the same time. First, you'd be prompted to add some photos and then you'd see a prompt to enter your list in details, etc. Now, once you go through that, you'll also see the option to uh, add where you want to receive your payments and the frequency of how often you want to receive those payments. So whether it's daily or biweekly or weekly or monthly, and you can also connect your bank account directly uh, to receive those payments. Now, for the, the file that you upload, where is it right here? The digital file that you'll upload. Um, I recommend uploading a PDF that has all of the instructions on what to do next, uh, how to receive the template, etc. So use that PDF to set any expectations and define uh, whatever terms you've you set up. So 